Shan Gone Quartz from the Chibuku uh, deposit, Zambezi Valley, Zimbabwe. This, uh, on, on first glance, we, we, uh, it appears to be predominantly smoky quartz. It is actually predominantly smoky quartz. I'm sure we'll find some traces of amethyst in here too. But let's first of all uh, move it around to give you a perspective of the crystal form. So what you look for now is the reflections of the, the quartz crystal. And of course, with good backlighting, you'd be able to see right through the guy. Uh, so it's a gem clear. There seems to be little under, seem to be little undertones of the amethyst on that side, going through. So there we have uh, one perspective of the of the actual shape. Yeah, there are definitely shots of amethyst in here. As I angle it in, angle it away from the light. Photography being the art of painting with light. Now we turn it over, and this is a different perspective on the same stone. Definitely amethyst, full of amethyst in that section. A lot of clarity in that point. So it could be displayed both ways around. Very, very interesting crystal form, as you can see. Uh, crystallographically, well, a, a small study would be <laughs> really, really uh, intensely crystallographically complicated. A little bit of Charles Sidney uh, uh, coating the outside. Um, I prefer this point of display. Let's just zoom in again. And with good backlighting, you'd have this effect. And maybe when we turn it over this way, let's see if we can get some of that an amethyst out there, so maybe angle it in a little bit like that, let's see, ah, there we go, all from Zimbabwe, Chibuku deposit, Zambezi Valley, Zimbabwe.